It is a bestseller on Amazon, which is awesome. And it just has all these little chain links that are hooked together and they're all rounded. Nothing's going to scratch it. It has this nifty little hook that you can hang it wherever you want to go ahead and hang it. You can see the little rings are nice and round so it's not going to scratch and they're really linked in together. So it makes this like awesome like little square cleaning pad. It's kind of crazy. And like I said, it comes in two separate sizes, 8x6 and an 8x8, so that you can have the option of having a bigger one or a smaller one. In this particular video, I'm going to be using the 8x6. Perfect. I'm going to be using hot water. I'm not going to use cold water. I'm going to use hot water. Just put a little bit inside the pan, and then I'm going to let the scrubber go ahead and do the rest of the work. So I'm going to take the scrubber and just start scrubbing away. And basically the soft like little circle chain links go ahead and just remove all the built on gunk uh, from cooking but yet it's still going to leave your pan nice and seasoned. Now I think this is where I had went wrong with my other cast irons that I would use soap and use all this stuff on it and not get off the water correctly and I know I'm a big like person on using soap and the dishwasher and everything but I kind of view a cast iron as like a barbecue grill so you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna scrub it you're gonna clean it but then the heat when you're cooking off of it is gonna kill everything so as you guys can see how easy it came off there's still a little bit left so I'm gonna go ahead and repeat it one more time just to make sure that last like little built-on gunk is coming off and that is it as far as just scrubbing it and cleaning it. This scrubber is super affordable. That's one thing that I absolutely love about it. It'd make a great Christmas gift coming up for the holidays for a stocking stuffer or anything like that. After I rinse it all off, I'm gonna get a paper towel, go ahead and dry off all the water. I'm gonna give you guys a close up so you guys can see how well that scrubber actually worked. I was very impressed um, and just put a little bit of soap on it just to go ahead and clean it up and make sure there is no chunks or anything left inside of it. Let it air dry and it is ready to go for the next time.